Right guys, so it's Friday. We have got a straw man event day today. We are training for the Shaw Classic, but as with a twist, we've got two special guests who come all the way up to the Highlands, Rongo and Fergal. Yeah, <laughs> so it's gonna be a straw man day. We're gonna take these guys through a straw man session. Obviously, Rongo has just competed with us at Giants Live Royal Albert Hall, and what a show it was. So let's have some fun. Let's get some dance moves on the go and let's get spicy. <laughs> Rubo Kini, also known as the Warrior. Now, guys, we had to climb about 10 mountains to get here, but we've made it. We have made it, guys. Now, I don't know what we're doing today, so I'm really nervous. The boys have just said, come along, jump in. We'll figure it out. We've got a few new faces here. And I just asked the question, what are the house rules? And apparently, we don't talk about the house rules. We're on going then. Oh, I need to, need to show up, boys. Feeling good. Um, yeah. It's an exciting thing going, events to train for a short classic. Sorry. Train to win the short classic. I've always been so respectful of the skill behind it and never naively thought I'd be able to do anything, which is why I'm so excited to be here today. And I'm simultaneously at the moment training for a sub five minute mile again. So all of my training is just very, very high intensity. I feel pretty lethargic day to day. Come on, Luke. Come on, give us a set, give us a set. Easy. Come on, come on, come on. This one here, this one here. Up. Easy. Yes, this is a I've been lifted this weight for many, many months, so. So why we come here? <laughs> That's what they do there, apparently. <laughs> Let's go, wrong go. Let's go, wrong go. Come on. Come on! Stop! Come on, Rongo! Beautiful, come on! Up, Rongo! I'm not, I'm not used to the weight, that's all. Yeah, that's good. So everything's sort of out. We're good now. Come on now. Come on, Come on. Nice, Tom. Come on. Come on. <coughs> Easy reps, Tom. Easy reps. Come on. Where's the heavy weight, sir? <laughs> That third one was convincing as fucking convincing. <laughs> Makes me feel like an absolute soy boy for not being able to get this up. But I am learning. There's little cues that I'm picking up today, but it just feels so alien. Let's go, boy. 
Yup, come on. Oh! It's not the shoulders. It's not the shoulders. Well, that has confirmed that my overhead press strength is about as useful as a chocolate teapot. We interrupt this program for an important news announcement. Hey guys, we are back in the kitchen, but this time we aren't cooking together. To celebrate the release of Elemental by Disney Pixar, HelloFresh have come up with eight different limited edition recipes. And they represent fire, air, earth, and water. So we decided to choose two different dishes and have a good old cook off. So comment down below on whose dish will look the nicest. Team Tom or Team Luke. Let's go! If you didn't know, HelloFresh is an amazing service where you can feel like a five star chef. They have amazing recipes that vary from high protein to veggie to low calories, you name it. My favourite thing about HelloFresh is that ingredients come pre-measured. All you do is follow the cooking instructions that come in the box and watch yourself cook a gourmet meal like it's nothing. Be sure to check out HelloFresh, click the link in our description and use code 60 Stoltman and get 60% off your first box and 25% off the next two months. Right guys, that's the two dishes done, nice and easy. I've gone for the chicken, Tom's gone for a load of fries. It's up to you who is the best dish, either Team Tom or Team Luke. Comment below. Thank you HelloFresh for sponsoring this video. You can now get 60% off your first order by using the discount code 60 Stoltman. And you'll also get 25% off your next two months. Thank, Thank you, you HelloFresh. Hello Come on! Let's see some power! Come on! Let's go! Come on, Rongo! Up, mate! Yeah! Oh, you beast, boy! We want to hold that one for the f***! <laughs> oh. Oh, <man. laughs> Happy with that, mate? Um, yeah, I am actually, considering um, did Royal Albert Hall last weekend and um, first session back since then, still not 100%. So to throw that up with the boys is honestly it's really good. So who knows if I'm um, strong enough, maybe be at Glasgow at the end of the year, hopefully. If not, then that don't mean anything. <laughs> <laughs> What is it about this place that just makes people look happy? Energy, baby. Energy. A good energy. You can do anything. But we that, boy. Energy. It's everywhere. You just have to know where to look. Oh. <laughs> 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 What's up, bro? Yeah. You want to study? Oh, yeah. What's I like having people up here? Yeah, I mean it's good. Um, but I think I used to get kind of. It used to go in my head a wee bit when I was doing some. You know, collabs and stuff, but now it's just having fun. Like I said, I think people are seeing me now with, you know, um, since post World Strongest Man, you know, I've rethinked a lot and I'm not coming into the gym like full of aggression. I'm coming into the gym happy, I'm coming into the gym buzzing and I switch on when I need to, just like competition. So, you know, if I'm coming into the gym aggressive and, you know, warming up with a log and feeling aggressive, I don't want to talk to anyone, that's not right. So I'm just trying to do what I do in comps and yeah, I feel. I feel unbelievable, I'm feeling just like I was in 2021-22 and uh, I mean my peak's still still here and that proves that after all Albert Hall, you know, I came back, I was deadlifting straight the day after for like 10, 11, 12 reps and now you know, my body feels good, a bit beat up with travelling and stuff but that's the, that's the life of a strong man but yeah, I feel very, very good, very positive, I'm in a very good mindset as well, I've, uh, you know, I've kind of changed, like I said, a lot of things uh, in my personal life to help me control gym life and Shay's been amazing, uh, the support system I've got around me is unbelievable and 
Yeah, I, I got some big records and I got some big titles to win. And I, you know, this is the kind of step and go to 2024 World Show, man. Because in 2021, I set like a record after the first day, but in 2024, I'm gonna blow the world up because I know when I'm 100%. Uh, no one in the world can beat me, and you know, I believe in that as well after the weekend's performance. But I'm just gonna have some fun. Rongo and Fergus are here, and you know, you don't get to train with people like these and uh, like this. Uh, too often, I mean, Longo lives at the other side of the world, so to have him here is special and to see him like, lift a 180k log was cool and I wanted to put on a show and you know, have some fun. You know, we're not doing all the shock class events today, but it doesn't matter, we're going to have fun. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> yeah, that was... <laughs> <laughs> Some of us are just here to have a good time, you know, and... <laughs> Your turn, Luke. <laughs> hit the top. Are you both trying to hit the top, or...? Yeah. <laughs> that too. It's going to be underwhelming. That's high. Come on. That's about the same. That's about the same, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nice. Why'd you hit the roof? I didn't mean to hit the roof. Much more power than I did last time I trained with these. Um, How heavy was that one? The one that I hit the roof with was 20 kilograms, the other one was about 27. Shaw's gonna have 30 kilograms, so it's nice just to get a few runs of that. We're gonna, now we're going on to arm over arm. Arm over arm is technique. Um, a lot of technique work on this, and we're gonna probably just load it up heavy and just Maybe do one or two runs with it and then probably just cap that off with the stones and that'll be good this week. I mean this week's been busy like I said, just back from competition. We're not pushing our bodies to the limit. We still got another three weeks of good training to go. So. Come on, Rongo. Come on. That's how you pull. The last one had to wait for the right pull. <laughs> Come on, Luke. Very good. Very good. Nice. Honestly, though, to be here to train with the brothers, man, I've been watching them and following them for years, and I watch all their videos, and to be in their environment, to hang out with them, and just vibe with them is absolute blessing. <laughs> Travelled to the other side of the world to be here and for them to open up their doors to me, Luke and Tom, just want to say from the bottom of my heart, for me and my family, my family here too, they're walking around the gym. Um, thank you for making us feel welcome and um, yeah, it's truly been a blessing to be here. So for all of you watching thinking, who's this chump that's turned up and not been able to do any of these exercises? Well. This is the one thing that I'm confident in today, so I'm gonna be pretty heartbroken if I can't move this weight because 207 in training already, the awkwardness of it's been where, where I've been struggling, but this is the one event that I've actually been sort of practicing in training. Everything else has been pretty alien today. Look at it, look at it. Come on, Bella. Come on, man. Come on! 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 Come
There we go. Let's Come go. on. Let's go. No more. Good. Good. Marcus. Come on. Easy. Fight that thing. Fight that thing. Come on. Wild, 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 Come wild, wild, wild. Hold, man. Come on. Please. Come on. Come on. It's hard that. It was better than last time, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was nice work. Yeah, that was a nice work. Yeah, yeah. Work. Yeah. Work. Yeah. Yeah, you can see, you can kind of get into that a bit more. It was good. Yeah, I felt looking forwards rather than down made a big difference, actually. Cool. Right. Arms feel okay? Uh, I think now that I'm over the hump of the first one, <laughs> it is what it is now, isn't it? Hurts them, doesn't it? <laughs> Hurts them. <laughs> Come on, come on. Good, Squeeze, mate. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. All the way, mate. All the way. Come on. Come on. Get that line. Get that line. Come on. Come on. Squeeze. Keep going. Keep going. Cheers. That was good. That was good. I enjoyed that. It's like a completely different. It's just fun, man. It's just new, and it's it, that that's something I felt a bit more confident on. So the stones and that I felt decent on. Everything else I felt like a proper schoolboy that's never trained a day in his life before. At the stones next, again, complete, complete new. And I hear there's someone reasonably experienced in Atlas Stones present. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Enjoying yourself? Yeah, well, that's good. That's <laughs> good, man. <laughs> it's cool, man. <laughs> yeah, so last event of the day is the bad boys at the stone. So um, I'm not. I've been doing some stone runs. I'm gonna train a bit heavier today. I wanna. Hit a 210 at the stone for a few reps. Um, I think that's what it is at Shaw Classic, so my body needs to keep being adapted to the heavy stone. So, see what happens. Nataki felt really good at the competition. Hopefully, it feels good today and uh, we can rock some heavy stones. <laughs> what are you going to do in the stone? Stone run or heavy stone like Tom? Uh, oh no, not heavy stone. <laughs> uh, I might just do a heavy, uh, stone run up to 180. Been done. <laughs> Job done. Are you ready for the stones? I'm honestly just pumped to watch. Tom with the stones. But I mean, look, you're gonna do a few stone runs, so. Pretty cool. I don't know about that top platform, eh? <laughs> like, to a normal person, it's like up here, but to Tom, it's like here. So it's like, I don't know if that's cheating or not. <laughs> well done, Dad. Come on. Oh, 
Hadi bırak dur. Hahahaha 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 Hahaha